Entering an invoice or sale and receiving a payment. In Aptora Mobile 2, training video. Training video overview. The purpose of this training video is to provide users with the skills necessary to perform the task of entering a sale or invoice and receiving a payment against that sale or invoice. This training video is broken down into three sections. Entering an invoice or sale, receiving a payment for the invoice or sale, and practical application scenario. Upon completion of this training video, users should have a good working knowledge of how to perform this procedure using the Aptora Mobile 2 website. To begin, log in to the Aptora Mobile 2 website and remain on the dashboard. Section 1. Entering an invoice or sale. From the dashboard, select the Quick Add Data View option. When the Quick Add menu opens, select the Add Invoices and Sales Data View option. After selecting the Add Invoices and Sales Data View option, the user is directed to the Customer Job Search page. Enter in a customer name or partial name and select the Go or Enter button on your device or keyboard to return a list of customer job results. Select the radio dial button adjacent to the customer to create the invoice for and then select the next button to continue on to the invoice form. When the user arrives to the invoice form in Aptora Mobile 2, they will notice the standard form display seen throughout the website, which features several action icons and data views for adding or editing information. Users may begin by selecting the Edit button found in the top right corner of the form. After selecting the Edit button, enter in as much information as possible within the fields provided from each data view option. Main information, additional info, addresses, and details. Once the user has added or edited all information on the invoice form, select the Save button found at the top right corner of the invoice form to save the invoice and information entered and continue to Items Data View option. Once the invoice has been saved, select the Items Data View option and then select the Add Items button. The Add Items page will open enabling users to enter item search criteria in order to return a list of item results that can be selected by radio dial button to be added to the invoice. After making the item choices, select the Add button to add the selected items to the invoice and be returned to the invoice form. At this point in the process, the user has created the invoice or sale and is ready to receive a payment against this invoice or sale. Section 2. Receiving a payment for the invoice or sale. Users should begin this section from the invoice form, as is typically the workflow of this function, and do not need to return to the dashboard or other menu to complete the payment receipt process. 
From the invoice form, select the payment method type icon relative to the type of payment being received from the customer. Users set up to process credit cards in Total Office Manager may do so by selecting the credit card payment action icon displayed as a credit card image. Users not set up for credit card processing in Total Office Manager have the option to choose the Receive Payment Action icon displayed as an image of a hand with cash. Note that user security permissions are required to receive payments in the AppTora Mobile 2 website, and users with the appropriate security permissions have the option to choose either icon, which would be based upon the customer's payment method and the ability of the company to use the credit card processing feature. If users are not set up for credit card processing in Total Office Manager, credit card payments may still be received using the Receive Payment Action icon and selecting the appropriate payment method. Payment methods are created and set up in Total Office Manager. For the purposes of this training video, we will not be covering the use of the Credit Card Payment Action icon. However, Users can select the icon to view the required data fields displayed within this icon's properties in order to discern its function. Enter the amount paid into the amount paid field. Select the payment method the customer is using and a check number if applicable. After making the payment selections, select the Save button at the top right corner of the form to save the payment information and be returned to the invoice form for further review, editing, or action. Practical Application Scenario At this time, select the Home button to be returned to the dashboard in order to begin the Practical Application Scenario. Scenario Create an invoice for a customer, add five items to the invoice, and receive a partial payment by check for the invoice total. After receiving the payment, obtain the customer's signature and print a copy of the invoice. Beginning from the dashboard, select the Quick Add Data View option. Next, select the Add Invoices and Sales Data View option. Enter in search criteria for a customer and select Go or Enter. Choose a customer and select the Next button. Select the Edit button and edit any information found in the Invoice Data Views. Select the Save button. Select the Items data view, then the Add Items button, and enter item search criteria.
choose five items and select the add button. Select the receive payment action icon. Fill out the receive payment form. Select the Save button. Select the Customer Signature Action icon. Enter a signature and select the Save button. Select the Print Action icon. At this time, if you have a printer connected to the device, you may print the invoice. Using the browser controls, I can see that I do not have a printer device connected to this machine. Note that this action will vary by browser. I am using Google Chrome on my iPad as my web browser. Because the print function in Aptura Mobile 2 relies on other hardware and configurations, printing instruction is not provided in this training video. To close the preview, select the X button on the browser tab. This concludes the entering an invoice or sale and receiving a payment Aptora Mobile 2 training video. For further review of our other training videos or to inquire about our other great products or services, please visit our website or contact an Aptora sales representative.